would like to officially welcome you to Reunion 2012. I came back to Barnard and I remember thinking to myself, Barnard is an exciting place to be and it's a world I want to be a part of. Barnard is better than I remember it and maybe better than you remember it too. What we do need to do over the next 10 or 20 years is to elevate the college. We need to take what we do and, we, and do it better and more loudly. And we're gonna need your help to get this all done. It's not just that my life began at Barnard. My consciousness began at Barnard because I learned how to think here. And not only did I learn how to think here, but I learned to accept myself as a thinker, as a woman who lived and breathed ideas. I was 10 years old. I was in a playground in the Bronx, and all of a sudden I had an epiphany. However, being 10 years old, that really wasn't part of my vocabulary. But it just kind of hit me that the only way to understand the world was to study science. The most important message that I took from Barnard was that I could do anything I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. And for me, the hardest thing was figuring out what it was I wanted to do. But that was my purpose. I wanted to be a music producer. That's what I wanted to do. But the question that Barnard and liberal arts helped me understand is why. I couldn't avoid being a feminist at Barnard when I was here. The campus was saturated with questions of women's rights, gay rights, sexuality, feminism. It was really that visceral uh, connection that is sort of has this spin of confidence. It's like a Barnard woman can do that. I'm a oh, guess what? I'm a Barnard woman. Maybe I can do it too. Let's take just a moment to thank all the faculty members who for each of us were the people who took us seriously here at Barnard. Isn't it wonderful that you can now listen and not have to worry about the midterm or the final? Uh, and if you think you're happy about that, you have no idea how happy I am about it. We who have had the benefit of an excellent education need to step up and get more involved. All I can say is that whatever I've done for Barnard over the last 50 years doesn't begin to touch what Barnard did for me. And I feel that my whole life began when I came to New York and went to Barnard. There's almost no one who I've met who hasn't been exciting, intelligent, thoughtful, and someone I really enjoy talking to. And that's the best thing about Barnard, no matter what the year. The women are extraordinary.